Lewis glides across the key, and we saw him do that a bunch. Go to his offhand the other way and have success with it. Just hangs in the air. He kind of glides, and with those long arms, can shoot over anybody in, in the lane. James Bishop. Yet they lead it by four as Maxwell Lewis has a clean look. And the rebound, Hunter Dean for GW. Racing up the floor and the lay in. Lorenzo Romar doesn't seem to be too thrilled with all the giveaways by Pepper. No, and, and it's interesting. They came out of the gate feeling good about their offense, but GW, give them a lot of credit. You know, their guards are pesky. They're known for their offense, but I think they're doing a very good job of containing the dribbler here in the last three or four minutes. Here's James Bishop. It's Basham. Gets by him. And glides in, splitting two. One-on-one -on -one matchup against Basham, and he just said, okay, I'm going to square you up and go. Malik Moore missing the three. Pepperdine's missed their last five shots. GW team, they play off two feet, and that time Adams under control with the explosive dribble, but the nice mid-range game. And a turnover leads to a transition three. James here this weekend is really remarkable. I had not seen them much during the before they got rid of And Houston Millette goes crashing to the deck, comes up grimacing a bit. But a tough shot by Millette to put Pepperdine up nine. And there is James Bishop. The scramble, Mike Mitchell with a three. And the scramble is what cost George Washington the ball game with three seconds to go last night. Oh, again, the presence of mind, and here comes Bishop to, to Andrew Puda. We saw the full court pressure. Now he's blitzing the, the ball screens, and he's just trying to create a, a tempo that's favorable to his team to try to speed up this game, maybe force some turnovers. Pull up on the baseline, and James Bishop. Now. You think GW might be creeping back in? They fly up the court and get a couple buckets. Another tough one for Brennan Adams. Kept alive by GW. And a tough shot in the corner hit. And Bishop's got hey! Jalen Petrie who's in double figures. Now that is smart, smart basketball. Started with Jamal Corey. Took the ball into the gap. He didn't force the issue. And then he threw it back out to Millette.